I'm Maria Montgomery. Hi, Maria. Nice hey, to meet you. Nice, to meet you. nice to meet you. Thank you for coming today. I've invited you here today to get your opinion on these two gooseneck trailers. Both are recognized brands within the trailer industry. However, to keep your opinion fair and unbiased, we've taken off all logos on the trailer so you don't know which brand is which. So would you like to check them out and see which one you like better? Sure all right, let's go. Richard, I like this gooseneck. That's very nice, yes. I like those heavy duty welds. Absolutely. And the thickness of these beams here are just, I mean. Look at that beat, look at that beat. Somebody knew what they were doing Yes, there. they did, that's, that's professional, very, very professional. Very stocky, very structurally sound. But look how beefy this thing is. And the braces, Richard. Yeah, I know, it's great. Look at the welds on those braces, sir. Wow, spare tire up in there. These reflectors, they, they, they could be lifesavers. Yes, they could. All, of, all, these, all these nice handy lights, sir. Nice big toolbox here. Diamond tread, buddy. Yes, sir. Diamond tread all the way around. You carry a lot of stuff in there. Diamond tread. Beautiful outfit. Easy to get up on, Richard. Even for an old Even man like you. Even for an old you. guy like me. Oh, yeah, very easy to get up on. A shin knocker of a step to get up. Check this out, Richard. If an old man like you can do it that easy, you I better know. better believe it. <laughs> Look at that, Richard. That is a good deal there. My 10-year-old boy could do that. Yeah. That is awesome. That is nice, very nice. Unbelievable. Look at these welds. Let me, let me see. You try it out, buddy. And you got a bad back. Look wow. at that. Wow. Look at that, Richard. You got the whole thing, man. That is great. You got, you got the whole thing. That is a good deal. Richard, look at these. He Did you check out these heavy-duty springs? Oh, yeah. All this lighting. Look at that fog light up there. Yeah, nice light bar back there. Yeah, that can break a foot. I wouldn't be afraid to haul anything on that trailer. Me neither, sir. It's aesthetically pleasing to look at. Yes, it is. Of course, Very... we, like, we like trailers, don't we? Yes, Richard? we do. We're trailer men. <laughs> what do you think about this trailer, Richard? Well, I don't know. Let's check it out, Frank. Can we get that up or down? Let's see. This is a little bit more complicated. Well. What is that, a bar across there? I guess that has to come off. You know the combination. Uh, I don't. We didn't, have no, we didn't need no combination on that one We didn't need a combination on that other truck. Be careful. Oh, my Lord. Be careful, Richard. Whoa, baby. Get out of the way. Wow. Look out below. I didn't like that. That didn't have no safety spring on it. No. I'm going to try this, Richard. That one just dropped. If this don't work, you call 911. Now, this old man did that one over there with no problem. Yes, sir, I know you, you did. You look like you're breaking out in the Well, slide. I'm telling you, this thing is not exactly what I should say user friendly. Watch, watch out below. Be careful. Lord have mercy. No. <laughs> That wasn't, that wasn't exactly user friendly, my friend Rich. Sure wasn't, that'll wear you out. Well, let me tell you. Just right off this trailer, I mean, it's a lot cleaner looking. It's got reflective tape on the sides, lights down the sides. I like the lock for the ramps. It's a hook instead of a bar you have to find somewhere to put. The ramp's definitely a lot easier to work. It sure doesn't look it, does This it? is a, a lighter, lightweight trailer to me compared, compared to, that. to that one over there. Dude. Yes, sir. Look at this step here, Richard. Lord have mercy. Watch this step. Now that Richard. doesn't look uh... Be careful. It's hard to get up here now. Where's the, where's the spare tire, Richard? Somebody get the tire, does it come with a tire? This one don't come with a tire. Now that's, that's not very easy to get up on there. That brake box is about half the size of that other brake box. And where's the light bar? There is no light bar. There is no fog lights. You're on your own, my friend. Steps are easy to get up. You don't have to worry about knocking your shin whenever you jump up there. <laughs> See a light bar, that's pretty, that'd be pretty nice. Your third brake light. This one actually comes with a spare tire. Got a step on either side, so 
You don't have to run all the way around. I have to walk under it. We have to figure out how to get off this thing. Looking oh, good, one way I know how Be to careful. do it, just dive in. Hold on, Help friend. me, Rich. Help. Be careful, my friend. Be I careful. don't like this. Be careful, buddy. All right, thank you. I'm a... Eye beams are a lot, a lot thicker. These beam garden there is beefy as those over there either. You know what, Richard, you got a point there. I believe those are spot welded. Hey, look here, I believe these these braces are spot welded. Yeah, they sure are. That other one was solid all the way through. I know. And these welds here don't compare. You don't have the lighting. You don't have the reflection no. tape. Now beams, they kind of, they're just a little small. You're gonna be doing some heavy hauling. Those are pretty small too. The feeder, they're thicker as well. More support. All right, guys, what you think? Got some good looking trailers, but we got one in particular we liked. Do okay. So after careful review, what did you think? What were the differences you found between them both? Well, we looked over both trailers really good, and trailer A just really sticks out. It's okay. uh, it's built a lot better. Um, it's just got a lot more. Uh, convenience like the steps are so easy to get up on it. Okay. This one here, I just about fell when I got off it. We can't be having that. <laughs> no, we can't. <laughs> what do you think, Frank? Richard, I like that trailer A myself. I love that stouter gooseneck, okay. the diamond tread on that toolbox. The whole front's diamond treaded. And if you notice too, Richard, remember that bed, the, the, the lumber is elongated. Yes. It's not spliced together like trailer B. And another thing was those ramps. They were so easy. Th this one over here, they just kind of flopped and fell. And much heavier. Okay. Kind of dangerous. And you get a spare tire too, Maria. Mm -hmm. And those chrome and wheels, nice those chrome wheels bar. top it all up. Very nice light bar back there too. Hey, what'd you think? I think trailer A. Do you think so too? Yeah, it was. So what'd you like better about it? Other than the fact that, I mean, it just it looks like a better trailer. It's, the eye beams on it's thicker, the feet, they're thicker. I like he was saying all the conveniences. You got a light bar on the back so you can see in the dark. Sounds important. Okay, are you ready for the big reveal and see which one's which? Okay, let's go. I'll let I'll you guys do the honors. honors. Thank you, Richard. I've been wanting to do this all day, Richard. Oh. Gator. Gator big made tanks. trailer. Okay. I wouldn't have guessed that. Okay, so after careful review and consideration, if you were gonna buy a trailer for your business, which one would you be more likely to buy? Without a doubt, I would go with the Gator. Okay. No question, Gator made. Yeah, I'm, to know. I'm gonna go with the Gator as well. Awesome, thank you so much for your time and we're happy to have your feedback. All right, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Go Gator. Yeah. <laughs>